Minister of Tourism, Culture and the Arts Randall Mitchell said events like the Blessing of the Grounds for the 2024 Pan-African Festival TT fosters a sense of unity, understanding and respect while educating the younger generation and ensuring that these traditions continue to thrive. The lighting of the flambeau is a powerful symbol that bridges the past and present, illuminating the path forward as we celebrate human freedom. The flambeau with its vibrant flame represents the undying spirit of our ancestors. Their struggle and their triumphs. It serves as a beacon of hope and a reminder of the enduring legacy of those who fought for freedom. Mayor of Port of Spain, Chinua Allen, said the corporation is always elated to work with groups like the Emancipation Support Committee. We have a specific interest in working alongside all of the groups, all of the organizations that are producing festivals here in the capital city. It's important for us because it provides us with an opportunity to grow and protect our heritage. And it also provides us with an opportunity to assist in the development of some local economic activity so that all of the people of Port of Spain have an opportunity to participate in the formal economy. Though many question if Africans are really free, Executive Chair of the Emancipation Support Committee, Zakia Uzuma Wadada, said there is much to celebrate. Life is about balance. We have to also have the positive with the negative. And where the positive exists, we have to take time to celebrate. So even as we have so many of our young people being impacted negatively, by this culture of violence, in the next few days, we are going to see hundreds of them playing their drum, dancing, learning to walk on stilts, playing the pan, singing. The ESCTT will also commemorate the 20th anniversary of the Caribbean Pan-African Network and the final year of the International Decade for People of African Descent. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TDT News.